Uh, hello everybody and welcome back to another video. So, uh, last episode we made this and all I did was go through and put more detail in. And, uh, I made the boss fight over here, which I'll go over in a minute. And, uh, just added some, uh, some, some detail around it to make it look nicer. Because, uh, especially when you're fighting the boss, uh, this is where you fight him. Instead of just a big plain there's trees and stuff so that's all a lot better and I put detail all throughout there but in order to let's just do the boss fight right now you talk to this weirdo doesn't say anything people keep on texting me then bam he starts and I gotta say it's pretty difficult The way to win is just to kill all the minions, so then it'll make it a bit easier. He'll decide to wear off as soon as he does the one hit attack. I see how it is. Somehow the NPC is in. go. So you just get a key from him then locks this door and we're going to be working on this next area right now. So I'm just kind of going to kind of make a pathway then I'm going to put a bunch of very overpowered enemies over in here so that you don't just venture off. But if you do make it through this area I'll have a little surprise over here later. Uh, Alright. Now to make the pathway, I was making out of these stone hedge things that look kind of cool. Alright, so we're heading over to there, which is the next boss fight. And uh, the boss fight that uh, I just made earlier, that I just fought, is basically practice for what this is going to be, because this is going to be chaotic. And uh, you'll see what I mean once I get there. So what I'm thinking for the boss over there is that there's going to be four mages. And yeah. Just, just four mages, and it's gonna be stupid difficult, but I'm doing it. Doing it, and no one can stop me. Then right here, just... Add that. Uh, 
Then what I'm gonna do, so basically these mages are gonna be undead. Yeah, spooky, I know. So and one right here, one right here. And now what I'm gonna do is there's these little skeleton things, just gonna have one at each grave. These are pretty much the mages. And one of them is going to have a letter. Although I'm not sure yet what to put on the letter. So. Uh, where are, where, oh wait, it's in NPCs. Alright, now what to put on it. Dialogue only. I'll add text on that later. I don't know what to put on it now, but I'm definitely going to put something on it. Alright. What are the stone hedge things? This, this could be kind of cool. Yeah, I like that. And we put in a wall like this. Uh, maybe a shorter one. This doesn't look very good. <laughs> there we go. Alright. And let's add in another one. Alright. Now to add in a checkpoint. It's going to be right outside the arena because, trust me, this is not going to be easy. Probably the hardest one yet. Uh, and just add in some trees. have to make a forest on this side too. So let's just go ahead and do that real quick. Oh no. Uh, whoops. And if you try to adventure on this side, it's pointless because I'm just going to add in a wall over here. It's, it's literally pointless to go in this direction. Oh, I was using the long one. Making this all line up is a lot harder than you think. There we go. And let's add in some of these. So 
really weird talking to myself. Well, you guys see it as I'm talking to you, but right now I'm pretty much just talking to myself. There we go. Perfect. Now for the enemies. Alright. Do I make a new enemy for this area or do I just reuse one? Hmm. I'm gonna make a new enemy. Let's see. So it's in a forest, so I think that might be good. Uh probably want to have armor since it's in a for forest. Let's do that. Uh, sure. These. Where's the pitchfork? Oh wait, it's right here. Bam! Pitchfork. Alright, now let's color this. Little bit of gray. Oh, that's... Little bit of gray. Actually, yeah, that does look better than the eyes. I really don't like the glow. There we go. And that right there, should I just go like that? Hmm. Uh, what color are the bones? Are they... Are they that? Oh no, definitely not. That? Oh yeah, alright, found the color. Bam! Uh... Change the color of those, uh, legs. Kind of a blue. And the shirt, the shirt's fine. And uh, I think that that's it for this guy. Health. Mm. Yeah, alright. Damage. Not too high of damage. Normal size. Uh, undead thing. Perfect. Then let's make a. Let's make the enemy that's going to make it so that you don't even want to get in the forest. So first of all, let's make it invisible. Because yes, we can do that. Actually, I'll, I'll give it feet so that at least you can see that. Let's go into here. Just a crap load of health attacks super quickly. Damage. I think that's a I think that's enough overall size, dude. Tiny. Uh nope. There we go. Oh, what have I created? I kinda wanna kinda wanna fight it. Well, let's move the spawn point. Then I'm gonna place one down and try to beat it. Let's place it right there. You can only see the feet. Oh, this is gonna be terrible. Ah! 
Yeah, it did half my <laughs> Alright, it doesn't have as much health as I thought it would, but that's still pretty strong. It killed me in three hits. Alright, time to spam these guys out here. <laughs> to make it clear that you should not be over here. I think that that's enough, actually. That's enough. Uh, trees. And, uh, let's place a little bit more, actually. Batman. That one might actually be a little bit too close to my aggro. There we go. Time to place them on this side. There we go. I think that's enough. Oh, they're everywhere. <laughs> oh, that's deadly. Alright. Uh, now time to actually start placing the normal enemies that are going to be in this area. Two right there. Then what you can do is you can actually set courses for them to walk. And right there. Let's make one for him. And I kind of, I kind of want to make another enemy to ambush you over there. Just a, just a m more powerful enemy. Or we can reuse the first boss and make it a normal enemy. <laughs> Where's that at? Thing. That's it. Alright, let's go here, give it a normal move set. Now let's keep everything else the same. You know, just, just reuse the first boss, one of the laziest things that you can do. And you know what? Let's put two of them. <laughs> oh no. Alright. Let's try this out. Kind of want I kind of want to go in the forest. Then see the running. <laughs> Hi guys, remember me? Oh wait. I may need to adjust something. Yeah, yeah, that right there, let's just... Mm, 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 mm. There.
Oh, wait a minute, I think I just did something wrong. Oh, wait, uh, I'm doing a bunch of things wrong. Uh, enemy thing. Yeah, yeah. Uh, that. Yes, yes, I do. This video is long. Alright, uh, and now I have to fix them. Yeet. Yeet. There we go. Now let's try them out. Oh yeah, that's a lot better. Mm, still not hard. Oh wait. Uh, ow. There we go. Come over here, see these things. Alright, now time to make the enemies in the run up to the boss. And bam, you're in here. Uh, I kind of want to make the floor gold or like silver or something. Something like, look at that. Or maybe gold would look better. Ooh, I kind of like that. Oh, that kind of looks cool. How about darker red? Yeah, I like that. I like that. Oh, that looks cool. All right. Uh, <laughs> Lights. Nah, we'll need no stinking lights. Need candles. Alright, now time to make the boss. So there's gonna be four of them. And it's gonna be chaos. Oh boy, what am I doing? Alright, the first one, we need someone that has a beard. This guy has a beard, but I don't like the mushroom. Aha, that one looks alright. Sorry, I'm quiet. I'm just trying to figure out which one works best. Alright. Now, since he's a mage, he needs a staff. He will have a stick. Beautiful. Alright. Uh, now, I'm going to give them all the same outfit because I'm lazy. So, the color of the outfit. Oh no. Oh no. 
Uh, that was not. Ah, right. Ooh, maybe dark red. Oh yeah, I like that. I like that a lot. I want to make these gold. Make that gold. Yes. All right, this is beautiful. Uh, now to make it look like they're undead, give them very pale skin. And the eyes. Yahas. All right, I really like this. Ooh, I want to make that gold too. Yay. That's, mm. Alright, I'm sticking with the stick. Alright, health. All of them are gonna have to have very low health or else this is just gonna be impossible. Damage. Uh, first mage. Alright, now let's make the second one. Don't really work well with the outfit though. Uh, uh, there we go. Back to here. Uh, here, let's do. Mm, there we go. Uh, Get rid of that. Uh, wrong thing. Didn't mean to paint that. There we go. Uh, and I think that's all. I still don't like that glow. Well, the magic is red, so I guess maybe I give it a red glow. Yeah, yeah, I like that. All right. Then the eyes. There we go. Perfect. Yeah, same move set. Then I kind of want to make the third one a support. <laughs> Kind of a support one, because there's a moveset, it isn't a boss moveset though, but it makes it so that it'll, it'll heal the boss, and I kind of want to make one of them that, but just give him a crap ton of health. So... Who looks like would be a supporter? This guy does. Let's give him that. Yeah, same arms. Different staff, though. Sure, that looks all right. Actually, no, I'm gonna change his hair. Mm. Mm. Yeah, all right. Now, where's the where's the healer one? Aha, uh -huh, it's restoration shaman. Health. He needs a lot of health. 
damage. He's not even going to be able to hit anything. Jeez, this is long. Alright, then the last one's going to just be basic Gandalf head. Actually, no, it's. Yeah, basic Gandalf. Uh, that. Alright, looks good. Actually, uh, different staff. Alright, there we go. Gold. Thanks for watching, and I'll see you guys later. Bye.